So you guys won last week. We did. That was pretty exciting, right? Yeah. yeah. So what brings you out tonight? Tonight I'm here to support not only the Women's Guild, but the amazing research, the amount of time and effort that is spent in trying to find the funding. $15 million worth of funding for this amazing research that is so needed, not only for women, but for people all over the world, and in the U.S. especially, that need it. And then we've got Norman Lear over here now. Did you grow up watching his shows? Were you kind of new to it, like with the, the One Day at a Time launching on Netflix now? Like um, a little bit new to it. I mean, of course, I, I've always known of that the amazing icon, you know, but, but, but still, um, I'm honored to be in the same presence in the same room, so yeah. I know growing up, like, I never watched any of his shows, but everyone would kind of talk about it, so for younger audiences, it's a little like, oh, so he made a bunch of shows that... And one day at a time, wow, amazing, so. So how does it feel, like, like what else are you up to aside from days? Because, like, soaps, soaps can be a little difficult. Yeah, of course, but I will say, I'm going to add something to this. I think what's happening right now, especially with Ron and everything that he's brought in this new kind of energy to the writing team, I think that our medium is just kind of, like, it shows that it is thriving. People love the drama. People can't get away from it. If they didn't have that, where would we go to? We would go to Empire, which is what? A primetime soap opera. So, you know what I'm saying? I feel like our medium is, is super thriving and I'm so happy and honored to be part of it. And uh, what was your original question? I don't remember. Oh, me neither. Cool. But yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, like soaps, soaps and drama, like... Oh, my All other projects and stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Sorry about that. Um, but, I mean, honestly, you know, because of soaps, they're crazy. They keep us working year-round. But I've been able to finagle a few films here and there. I've got a film coming out soon. It's a creepy... Um, it's a thriller. I play, like, a bad girl. Of course. <laughs> no surprise there. And it's called Healing Hands. It'll be on Lifetime, I believe, or Hallmark. So it'll be for film. A, a film for TV. So, yeah. Look out for it, Healing Hands. Because I know your co-star Jen Lilly does a lot of like Lifetime and stuff like and that. And Kate Manzi as well. Oh yeah. Yeah. Like, do you guys have you guys all been able to be in like a Lifetime movie or like talk about that? You know, it's funny. Um, Kate and I were in the talks of actually being in one together, and then timing didn't work out because scheduling is really hard with soap operas. But um, but it would be great to do something together. I mean, I feel like all of us are kind of have been in one, so it'd be awesome to be in one together. Yeah. Awesome. That's Maybe somebody has to write the right story and sell it to Lifetime. Soap stars behind the scenes. <laughs> awesome. Great Thank to talk you. with you. Nice.